here today. Um, her name is Ellie Montgomery. I'm still getting used to saying her new name. She's newly married, um, Ellie Shepley Montgomery. And um, I'm going to have her just share with you what happened when she said, what if? And um, you get to be witness to the amazingness of Ellie. So go ahead, Ellie. Thank you so much, Jill. Um, hi, everyone. Uh, I'm sorry I'm in a cab right now, but just shows you that you can do this business from anywhere. Jill asked me to speak and I was like, sure, you know, this is mostly how I do my business is, you know, on the road from anywhere. I love to travel. I recently moved from New York to Los Angeles, California, and I spent a year before that traveling. Um, okay, I'm going to just one second. <laughs> I know. So I'm going to get out. Just give me one second. I'm sorry, guys. Listen, don't apologize. Okay, this is what's so cool about this. So Ellie, first of all, the fact that she said yes, she just said, yep, not a problem. I can do it. And I didn't know she was going to be traveling, and I thought she was home in California and in and out of cabs, but she's just willing to do it because this is what we do for each other. We're just a community that helps each other, and she's so generous. But on top of that, like she said, this is how she works every day. She lives her life, and she talks to people like this and helps people. So go ahead, Ellie. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Um, so... Yeah, so I um, have been taking Juice Plus since I was 14 years old. My mom learned about it from her uh, sister, and it made total sense to her. You know, I was 14 at the time, my sister was 11, and we were pretty much using broccoli as a dipping mechanism to get more ranch dressing in our diets, the dip and slurp and put the broccoli back. So she thought if we can get, you know, beets, broccoli, kale, spinach, cabbage, all these things in gummies, you know, for us and, and capsules for her and my dad, that is just a no brainer. So we got started on it. Um, our company has a children's health study where kids can get the product for free if an adult sponsors them. So my mom sponsored my sister, my dad sponsored me, and we um, for very affordably started on this as a family of four. And what happened really blew my mom away. Like it completely changed the picture of our health. None of us have been on antibiotics in 14 years. My allergies went away. My skin improved. My energy, my sleep, my cravings. Um, I will never go a day without it. So I uh, started my businesses at 18 years old. I was in college and just looking for a way to make some extra income. And because I grew up, you know, my mom started sharing Juice Plus pretty much right away. And I grew up in this really positive Juice Plus community. So I really believed that I could do anything that I wanted with my life. And I decided that I wanted to be an actor. And I moved to New York City to act. And I was nannying and catering and teaching yoga and just like piecemealing together this, this income. Um, and meanwhile, trying to audition and act and just got completely broken down by the competitive environment. And I truly hated it. You know, I, I didn't like going to auditions and sitting next to a girl and, you know, people would be mean and catty and you'd feel like the person next to you is your competition. And I just didn't grow up in that kind of environment. I grew up with the most supportive, loving women <laughs> around me who are all building each other up and supporting each other. So because, you know, through this Juice Plus, through seeing my mom build a Juice Plus business. So I was just like, I don't actually want to do this. I act. And um, that's when I decided to really look into Juice Plus as a career. And I went to the company conference and I saw thousands of people of all people. Sorry, I just got a call <laughs> and I just find it. Um, people of all ages who are having success, making income, making a difference, having fun. And I was like, this looks awesome. And I could you know, build a, a, an income stream and a business now that, you know, in five years could allow me to have complete freedom and live the life that I want to and travel and, and um, make a huge impact. So I was totally, uh, totally on board. And I moved back to New York and I started working this um, as a business. And, you know, I did jump into it as a career. Most people do this as a way to make some extra income. So I want to be clear about that, that there's really something for everyone in this. You know, a lot of my friends do it to make some extra money or cover the cost of their product. Um, some people want to make, you know, an extra $500 to $1,000 a month, which can significantly change most people's lifestyle. Um, I really wanted it as a career. 
So I jumped right in. Um, I, you know, worked it like a business, you know, professional. And I, I've really treated this like a business. Um, and the, the coolest, you know, newest part of my story um, that I love to share is that two years ago, I met my now husband in New York, and he was from Cape Town, South Africa, of all places. And anyone with a normal job would go, you know, this is never going to work, and I'll see you later. Um, but because I have this, this business and this freedom to, to choose, I was able to go and spend time in Cape Town and travel all around. And I basically spent a year traveling and my, I've had my best year ever with my business. It's grown more in the past year than ever before. And I was traveling for an entire year and run it, growing my business from my phone, from, you know, beaches in Cape Town to, um, it, you know, hiking in Scotland and just, it was a magical, you know, magical year. And, um, I make a solid six figure income. I get full health benefits from this company. Uh, my husband, who's also an entrepreneur is now on my benefits plan. So we both get benefits from this company, which being an independent contractor, like owning your own life and being able to have a benefits package that rivals any corporate benefits package is completely unheard of. Um, so I could not be more grateful. My favorite part of the whole thing is that it's all about helping people and changing lives. And I love helping people with their health and getting texts that, you know, people's digestion is healed and their, you know, autoimmune is improving and all the different things that happen when people get on Juice Plus. Um, but my absolute favorite thing is helping people change their lives. And I have a girl on my team who had, you know, just, she's a yoga instructor, had very little income, was looking at having to take a corporate job and just in the past year has completely changed her life and has freedom and flexibility and is surrounded by this incredible team and is empowering other women. And, you know, we do have men in this business, but I really love how it allows women to just be total bosses. <laughs> you know, there's no glass ceiling. We all support each other. It's, I mean, I really believe that there are, I think more and more we're learning to build each other up and support each other as women, but there aren't many places where women can really shine because just the corp, you know, we live in a patriarchy, a, a, you know, a male dominated world. And most corporations are male dominated. And this is not, this is female dominated. And we are, we are, do, we are taking out, like we are rocking it. And it is so, so fun to have this um, vehicle that really allows women to thrive, to, to own their own lives, to make their own money. Um, I was watching this uh, show, a, a Beyonce show last night. This last thing I'll say, I was watching this Beyonce show and she's going through all her old hits and her, her songs are like independent woman. And like, you know, they're just, I, I was watching her and I was like, you know, I'm not Beyonce obviously. And I do look at her and I'm like, what would it feel like to be Beyonce? But I feel like the Beyonce of my own world. <laughs> Like, I feel like my own version of Beyonce, and that is so crazy, because I used to not feel that way. I mean, there were many years where I was, you know, taking care of kids and nannying and feeling like, I know that there was a Beyonce in here, but how am I going to get her out? And, um, and this, this business has really been my vehicle to do that. And so the income is great, you know, the helping people is great, but, you know, it's all wonderful. And but, but having a vehicle to, to be the woman that I want to be in the world and make the kind of impact that I want to make, there's just nothing. I mean, that's, that to me is, is the best part of all of it. And Ellie, would so, you say yeah. all of that and on your own terms and your yeah. time, on your schedule that you For sure. Find, that's the part that fascinates people. They can't really believe but but that I think the flexibility and the ownership of that is worth another six figures or more, right? Yeah. Because there are people who are loving what they do and they're mm -hmm. making as much money as you or more. But guess mm -hmm. what, right? They don't yeah. have time. Totally. And and that was one of my big things because I I'm really excited to be a mom one day. I really want to be a mom. And I um see see women all the time, especially in New York. Um, my cousin is one of them. She works for Tori Birch. She has a great job. She loves it. And she just had her second baby and she is now back at work commuting from New Jersey into the city. 
And she just looks at me, she's like, I love my job and she doesn't want to leave it and they can't give up the income. But she is really just devastated that she is not able to be with her babies and, and see their life. She leaves them with a nanny all day long. And I just, I know that, so, you know, we, we fall in all different areas of the spectrum, right? Some women are like, they know that they want to go back to work and they don't want to be home and that's great. And some women like only want to be home and that's awesome. I don't mean only, but I mean like they know that that's what they want to do. But I think there are a lot of women who fall in somewhere in the middle where they want to be able to be home with their kids and be present and be, you know, involved, but they also want their own thing. You know, they want their own income or their own business or their own tribe. And so I just love giving women options, you know, that we can have our own business, but, but not have to choose between being home and, um, and being a boss.